Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have a Wegmans haul. I just ran into Wegmans to get a few things. My niece is spending the weekend and we spent $142.37. So let's see what we got for that. Of course, look at these beautiful flowers. They were only $8. So pretty. And at least they were cheap, right? So um, my niece said get some fruit. So I picked up um, some fruit. We got the clementines. We got the uh, gala apples. I believe those were like $1.99 a pound. I've tried to find the best pack of strawberries I could. Obviously, they're like not in season. Those were $4.99. Picked up some big blueberries. About to make some oatmeal and put my blueberries and walnuts in there. So delicious. Picked up some yogurt. Um, picked up the family pack of peppers because I want to make fajitas tonight or like fajita bowls. Um, picked up a white onion for fajitas. Picked up some grapes. Those were $1.99 a pound. Um, picked up a bag of avocados. Those were $4 and there's like four small size avocados in there. Picked up some cucumbers because I do have salad and cherry tomatoes left in the refrigerator. I wanted to do like the TikTok pasta with the cherry tomatoes, but there was no fresh basil that looked good at Wegmans this morning. I like to get like the fresh basil plant and they just didn't have any that looked good. They had like a couple dying ones. Um, picked up some sukis just in case the kids want to snack tomorrow. Got chicken tikka masala. Um, picked up the uh, coconut curry and then one of the chicken biryani. So we'll give those a try. I mean, I love sukis. I'm not sure if my niece, um, she has a peanut allergy, so I'm not sure if this would be a problem or not. I was trying to read the ingredients in the store. Um, this one actually comes with the non bread inside too, so I think that's kind of cool. So I definitely love sukis. Um, I think we've definitely had the tikka masala and the coconut curry. Um, those are two that you can find at Costco, but I don't think I've had their biryani. Um, picked up some turkey breast and some Colby Jack cheese and some sourdough bread in case my daughter wants to make a sandwich tomorrow. So for breakfast, I thought I would pick up some cinnamon rolls. thought the girls could do the cinnamon rolls in the little mini um, pancake maker. You know, those, the little orange pancake maker or waffle maker that puts the pumpkin impression on, on the pancake. So you can put the cinnamon roll in there cook it through, and then put the icing, the frosting on top. So I thought they can play around with that tomorrow. Um, some turkey bacon, orange juice, uh, sour cream, not the healthy sour cream, but I couldn't get to, to uh, mom's to get the healthy sour cream. Um, but that's for fajita bowls, um, the fajita seasoning packets, and some chicken tenderloins for the fajitas. Um, pick these up, the crusties, I guess that's how you pronounce that. Um, all the muffins come out perfect. Pick this up to have um, some muffins for breakfast since she's staying the weekend. Picked up the walnuts for my um, oatmeal that I'm getting ready to make. Picked up the extra creamy whipped cream. I thought I would make some pumpkin pancakes tomorrow for them. Um, we have the mix from Trader Joe's and then we can put some whipped cream on top and then maybe sprinkle some pumpkin spice. On top of that, it looks so cute, right? Picked up some chocolate chip cookies for them to uh, bake and play around with. I guess the, uh, I'm not sure if there's any, we need to be concerned about peanut allergies on those, but I'll let her, she's a grown adult now, I'll let her read that and, and make that choice, make that decision. Um, and then picked up the Pillsbury Monsters. They can play around with those too. And so that's everything for $142. I did get some aluminum foil cookie sheets, but the way I had them on the cart, they totally slid off my cart, and I literally mangled them under the wheels of my cart. So those are still in the car. I'm not sure if I can salvage them or if they just need to go right into recycle, but that's everything, guys. Now, the Sukis were kind of expensive. They were $6.49 each, so for three, that was like $21 right there. Um, but yeah, other than that, I just kind of wanted some things that they could just snack on, make it like a brunch style breakfast um, before they go to work. They're working at um, a uh, Fields of Fear in the evening, so just so they have enough snacks throughout the day. So 
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment down below, and please subscribe if you're not already. Thanks.